All right, guys, Pro Dumpster Diver back here, back at it again. Had a crazy haul over the weekend, but we did pretty damn good, man. All right, so I'm going to go over this real quick because I'm about to get something to eat. Found this actual flat mini robot. It's not a Roomba, but it's one of those other cheaper versions of it. But it basically tries its best to clean and vacuum and everything like that. But it's practically pretty good. It's probably one of those bounce ones. I found this 24-inch clock. It looks like one of those ancient ones, but I looked in the back of it. It's not really, like, that rare at all. But it's still a pretty good clock, though. I'm not going to lie. So, yo, I went inside this dumpster. I found all these keyboards. These are brand new keyboards that haven't been used, right? But they probably came as... A, a setup and like an all-in-one with a mouse and everything and they decided they wanted to keep their keyboard so they threw these out these haven't even been opened right but they look pretty good and they threw out these other keyboards and everything like that now as a scrapper I can take the mylar out of this and the mylar sheets are worth about nine cents like that's it they're not worth much but if I have a keyboard like this and I sell this keyboard I can sell this for three dollars so would I rather make nine cents or three dollars? I'd rather make the three dollars, but I put them up on Facebook and so far nobody really counted up to it. So I'm gonna see how far up it goes right now. So if people do wanna buy it, I'll probably go ahead and actually sell that right now. But as I said, three dollars is pretty good for all of this because again, it's in the trash. But again, like these are brand new keyboards. Like one, two, three, four, five, like somebody can actually use this. Like, these haven't even been opened yet. Like, dude, what the fuck? Actually, let me open one. Because this is what, it, this was crazy. I'm not saying, like, these people are rich, but, like, it's it's just, there are other keyboards in here. And some are wireless, you know? Some are wireless, you know? It's got the batteries in it and everything, you know? But they're just HP. I'm going to leave that as it is. So, I found an Apple desktop, right? This is an Apple desktop, and it's a 2006 it's pretty good. It looks good. I checked the back of it and everything. This is the back portions of it. If you can see and I can zoom in on that. It looks pretty good. As I said, I uh, also found a nice flat screen TV here, which is pretty good there. It actually works, but no one wants it. So I'm going to scrap it out. Now, this is not an iPhone. It's an iPhone box. I put it up online. No one wanted it. I found a hard drive. Got a hard drive here and a phone system. I'll throw that out. I got me two printers, real nice. I'm about to scrap the gold and ink out of these right now. I found this duster and some Raid. Man, these dusters are actually pretty nice. These are air dusters. Now, I, always, I, I consider these to be gold because it gives you fast-moving air in a small package, which is nice. All right. Uh, somebody had a little GPS thing here. This is nice. Like, these things actually, I plug this in, it works. I can stick it to my windshield, but somebody said you might get a ticket if you have something stuck on your windshield, let's say GPS. All right, and it's not a phone. I don't know. I don't know. But that's a pot. I'm going to throw the pot out. Um, I found this Rampage thing. This is women's boots. I'm going to put these online, see who wants it with the size. Dude, oh, I found these tool sets. Look at this shit. Somebody threw this out. I actually picked this out of the same dumpster out of that other stuff. This here didn't belong in it, but it's pretty nice. It's a Phillips head. This is nice as heck, man. Like somebody actually threw this out. I guess when they were done with their work and everything, it looks like a professional set. I don't know what company makes it though uh shoot i don't even know how you put this shit in there i guess that's how it is okay uh but yeah it's nice oh hurricane okay like they threw this out and there's a thing like there's another blue like this other blue set somebody have thrown this out as well i think i showed this to you guys in a previous video but there's drills in here and everything like this is nice i could sell i saw this in harbor freight for maybe like 19.99 or on sale for 14 but it's pretty good though bro i don't know why people throw this shit out like it's got all the bits in it and everything but again this is the age of coronavirus and somebody like me who's probably rich threw it out i don't know i found two xboxes one probably doesn't work one probably does this is old but this one might have the red ring of death this one i don't know why they tried to part it out they might have tried to fix it i don't know uh but i can i can go ahead and figure that one out uh got some wires in there this one, I got a lot of Ethernet wires and cable, and then some phone systems and a D-Link set in there. This is something interesting. This is a NG Cyber Roam. I don't know what that is, but it's in here with all the antennas and everything. So I might put that online or I might just throw it out. But the thing is, it might be worth it. Who knows? 
I still don't know what that is. I'm not gonna bother doing the research because I have a lot of other stuff. So I put, I'm gonna put this up on Facebook. I'll probably get five for this. I'll probably get $3 a piece for the keyboards. I'll scrap out the printers, scrap out the TV, the Apple desktop. I'll probably sell for maybe 25 or 50. Uh, the wires are all copper. I'll keep the tool sets. And um, yeah, that's probably it, man, but it's not bad. Today's a pretty damn good day right now. Today's Monday, so this is a great way to start the week off right now. I love those dusters because they're pretty good, so I'm going to keep that. All right, guys, I am basically out right now. I don't know what you guys are doing, but you should probably start up a YouTube channel because it's passive income you'll always have for years to come. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Pro Dumpster Diver out.